We have finally done it. We have contacted Kyocera a long time ago and we have finally received a review sample of their KY01L. We have seen this a bunch of times in passing at trade shows in Japan and Taiwan and consumer electronics shows in Las Vegas. We've never had one in our hands and here it is today. This is a review sample, so it's already kind of open, but we are going to do the best we can with what we have. This is the device right here this is the smartphone this is a cell phone right here and we're going to be doing a lot of uh d deep dives into this device because it is running e-paper e-ink so putting it up against a regular smartphone you'll see that um it's very small and it's very thin that's the whole point of this thing is that it is essentially a credit card or a card Ketai, they call it a card phone and it's less than 50 grams it's incredibly small there's only two buttons on the uh, bottom for back and um, home there's uh, volume up and down because this does have a tiny little speaker it does have a power button and a, a sleep button it does have nano sim and of course it's a Japanese product so we have the stylus uh, not stylus sorry the loop for uh, you know little charms and whatnot you do have a microphone and a speaker on it so it can do little beeps and boops and stuff it is full flush screen and bezel it is matte and it is super super small very small that's the whole point of this uh, let's explore the rest of the box first and then we'll show you what uh, the device actually has um, now uh, obviously we've opened this it's not uh, we're not staging this it, it was an open review sample however I couldn't find out where they obviously there's no USB they didn't give us one which is fine because it's just a micro USB but there's not even really room for one um, there could be one for a really really flat cable in there but honestly like it's it's like the size of my thumb. So honestly, I don't know where they would keep a USB cable. Might be one of those really small USB cables, but uh, yeah, they didn't give us one. That's fine. Here is the SIM removal tool. It's really just a, a, uh, an over stylized paper clip. So you don't have to worry about that. The inform information package here, uh, the device is in English. Uh, it comes in English and Japanese, but the manual only comes in Japanese. Now, a very interesting thing about this device is that you can't really buy it. You can't go to a store and buy this. Some stores will have this outside of contract, but because you see here it says Docomo, that is the equivalent of, say, AT&T or Rogers Wireless. Um, that is the cell phone company that they use as their, uh, you know, entry into having this device available for people but you have to get it on contract really so you have to go into a store and grab this there are uh, um grab a cell phone plan i should say and pay for this monthly if, and even if you were to get the cell phone plan and then cancel you'd have to pay it out anyways there are some resellers selling this upwards of 500 dollars, but uh, it's not cheap there is a decent amount of technology in here for the size it's got vibration um it's got uh you know a little speaker at the bottom so it does as i said beeps and boops and stuff we are going to do a full review on this of course so we're just going to do a first time startup and show you guys that it is real and it's not a dummy unit that you see in the uh the stores um obviously black and white it is e-ink so that's uh what they give you inside the box we'll just start this up And we're all started you see the background um, i put that in uh, i already know this device so yeah um you see it it can do functions and it is real so and it is in english so we will uh do our best to do a full review on this and you know what else we're going to do we're going to do our best to see if we can get some sort of business relationship with kyocera in the sense where we can actually sell these to people it's not a cell phone you're going to want to use day to day unless you um do not like fast things this is very slow and it's very limiting the size of the screen is two of my thumbs so we will do some scale and some full review on this it does have wi-fi it does have bluetooth so we're you know it's a real device that we're gonna check out for now this is an unboxing everything that comes in the box for goodyreader.com and the kyocera ky01l this is peter